Yo, what's going on, True Fam? Welcome back to the channel. It's White Shadow, and today, guys, I'm gonna show you a fun little trick that you can do to enhance your stream in SLOBS or OBS. So let's go ahead and jump into it. All right, guys, so today I'm gonna be showing you a fun little trick, and it's the zoom effect how you, and how you do that in OBS. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump over to my overlay here, and I already have OBS up and running. I am recording with SL OBS. Gonna kind of get confused with some of the cameras here in just a second, because I have two cameras running, one for my OBS on this side. You have your overlay here or your video scene or whatever the heck you guys call it. This is all of your scenes in OBS. What you're gonna do, we're gonna start out by adding two scenes. So the first one I'm gonna name Zoom, and then I'm gonna add another scene. I wanna call that Zoom 2, just for the sake of switching them up and making it easy to remember. So go to your first Zoom. So the first thing you're going to add is your video capture device, which I named mine Camera 2. Yours will probably just be your main camera because most people don't run two cameras. So do camera, I'm gonna do camera two, but do your main camera and then boop, right there. Hi guys, you can see me in two places. Before we do anything else on this one, I'm gonna go to zoom two and I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna add the camera two, boom, got that one. Now, I'm gonna go back to the first zoom. I'm gonna add in my audio input capture my, that's my mic and or auxiliary, whatever you call it. And then I'm going to add in my audio output capture, which is my desktop audio. That's what I have named mine. And then I'm going to add a display capture as well, because I'll show you why here in a second and drag that to the bottom. Make sure it's underneath the camera or it will cover your face. Listen, listen to what I say. And then the other thing I usually like to add in, you don't have to if you don't really feel like it, but I like to add in my alerts just in case. I do it just in case, guys. Just in case we get like a follow or a sub or something like that. And I try to keep it as far away from my face as possible. I mean, it's still gonna be covering part of your face. So put it wherever you feel. This is kind of up to you. I'm just gonna put it there for now because we're probably not gonna get an alert here. Copy all of these, or you can duplicate or whatever, but I like to just add everything in to make sure it all gets put in. So we're gonna do the same thing on the Zoom 2 here. We have Zoom 1 and Zoom 2 identical to each other. Now, you're probably asking, dude, you're not zooming in. Here's where it gets tricky. You ready for this chat? Hold on to your pants. Hold on to your pants. You're gonna take this thing and you're just gonna drag it. You're just gonna drag it like that until you're kind of somewhat zoomed in. See the differences between the two? That's a difference. Yeah, that's a big difference right there. And we're gonna do the same thing to this guy. We're gonna take our camera and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this one and we're just gonna zoom in big time. Boom, bibbidi bop, there's a floating head in the middle of the screen. You see that? You see that? You see that, guys? So boom, see the difference? And then boom. Boom. And then boom. And you can see me in like 300 places here. So yeah, that's how you get the zoom effect. And I'll show you guys what it really looks like here in just a second. So this is what it looks like on when I'm streaming. I have mine programmed into the stream deck. So you go boom, boom. What's up? See that? Boom. Boom, 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 and then you go back. So that's how you set it up. It's super easy, super simple, and it doesn't take a lot of time. And you can program all of that stuff into the stream deck so it's like readily available. So you can just pop it back and forth if you need to. You can really play around with this stuff too. You can tweak it to where there's different angles and all of that fun stuff. But uh, yeah, hopefully this helps some of you guys and hopefully it makes sense. Um, it's a super, super easy trick that a lot of people think are advanced, but it just, it creates a cool little aspect to your stream. And um, I super, super love this. So um, guys, thank you so much for taking a look at the channel. Thank you for coming out to the video. I appreciate you. If you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you did not like this video, do not give it a thumbs down. Just don't do it. Just, just stay away from the thumbs down button. And I will see you guys in the next video. This weekend, we are running a charity stream on the True Gaming channel. The link to that is in the description below. A ton of sponsored streamers are gonna be on the channel, including yours truly. And you might even see a True Mama on the channel. I don't know yet though, but I'm, I'm, I've heard a rumor, True Mama is gonna be there and she's gonna be sipping on some lemonade. So guys, be sure to follow myself and True Gaming on all social media. I'd love to see you guys come out to the stream this weekend. And um, I'll see you in the next video. White Shadow out.